Hey you guys, one of my favorite videos of all time to do is talking about these Sephora bonus events. Today, the spring bonus event officially begins. If you're a Rouge Beauty Insider member, you can save 15% off of your purchase. I'll put all the info below as usual. The Rouge Early Access event is going to take place from now April 13th through April 16th. So you have this weekend to shop. If you are a Rouge member, I'm gonna show you all of my recs. I'm gonna do a look using the Anastasia Soft Glam Palette, you guys. This is um, pretty exciting, so we'll talk about that. I'll do a really quick um, tutorial, but I want to run through some of my top picks with you guys for this event, and I want to give you guys all of the details. So I already shared all of the details on the Rouge Early Access. You save 15% using the code below. You can shop via the link below. And like I said, I'm gonna give you guys all of my best recs, and that is for Rouge members only this weekend. So what's really exciting is that if you are an existing Sephora Beauty Insider member, or you're not and you wanna go ahead and sign up now. I'll put the link below so that you can sign up now if you have no idea what I'm talking about and you're not a member but you wanna save and you wanna take part in this event as well. I'll put that link below so you can join. So all of the existing Sephora Beauty Insider members as well as new ones that sign up can shop on the 20th. So April 20th through the 23rd is the Sephora Beauty Insider weekend. Sephora Beauty Insiders will save 10% using the code below. You can save in store and online. And if you are a VIB member, you will save 15%, which is awesome. So I will also put your code below because it is different and you can shop in store as well. And if you are just joining me and you can't shop Rouge right now, well, guess what? You can load up your cart. You can check out some of these good recommendations. So I'm so excited to be collaborating with Sephora on this one, you guys. As always, I just, I love these events. I'm so excited to share with you guys everything. So. All of the details will be below on this event, everything, but let's go ahead and get into the goods because I really have so many good things to share with you guys. You guys know that I have so many must-haves from Sephora and I think that you definitely don't wanna miss out and think, dang, these are products that I don't normally use, get a discount on, so why didn't I buy them then? So definitely don't miss out. I say stock up on what you love, that you know that you always repurchase at Sephora so that you can get a discount. Buy things that are a little more, little like luxury items, maybe some fragrances, things that you don't normally purchase a lot but that you can get now and save a discount. You know, it's like fun things you wanna try, anything. So let's get into it. As spring, summer begins, I always buy like an SPF powder sunscreen and I'd never try this one by Supergoop. It's the Invincible SPF 45 um, setting powder, 100% mineral, and it's sweat resistant. So I got the translucent shade. Love these because I can just keep it in my purse. You just dab it out and you can, you know, boop, 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 boop. love that. And this one's translucent. So if you're in the car a lot, you can take it out and kind of, I always am paranoid about that, you know, like put on your cheeks a little bit. I'm going to have so much stuff on my face because I want to show you guys a new highlighter too. I got a new Buxom lip gloss. These are some of my favorites. I got it in the color Abigail and I've gone through so many of these different colors and so I always try to get a new color. And this one is so pretty because the shimmer is just so fine. These are my favorite. I just love these lip glosses to wear by themselves and they give such a pretty effect. They make your lips feel so good and like cool and comfortable and they make them look a lot plumper. I also got another lip product, my very favorite Abs, I would say this is my absolute favorite liquid lipstick of all time, and it is the Kat Von D Love Sick. This is such a pretty color, you guys. I hate to take this off and put it on. I might in a minute. Yeah, I'll go ahead and put it on because I love it. Such a good color, right? It's just perfect. I love it. These always feel comfortable. This is just, if I had to pick one liquid lipstick of all time, it would be this one in this shade. Love sick. Love it so much. Let's go ahead and do the tutorial super fast, and then I'll show you guys some more stuff. I have so many fun things, you guys. Um, but let's just go ahead and do this, because I know that a lot of you guys do want to see this. Some of you guys may be watching just to see the tutorial, but it's the Anastasia Soft Glam Palette. I was really drawn to these colors. There's just such a good mix. There's good, just basic colors, there's good different colors, and I just love the look that I created with it. So let's go ahead and do it real quick. We're gonna use this. I'm gonna use a primer real quick. This is the Anti-Aging Primer by Urban Decay, which is my favorite. I'm gonna use this rose pink in the middle, and I'm really gonna just like pack that on the lid. I'm gonna take this color called Rustic with the fluffy brush and blend around that. I'm gonna take this bright color, this orange soda, just to brighten it up around that. This tempera shade, just 
to go ahead and highlight. Put a little right in the middle. I'm gonna take this dusty rose color. So on the outer corner, I'm gonna do like a little bit of, I want it to look a little plummy, like a little mauve -y. So I'm gonna kind of build it up. And then this mulberry color is like, like a reddish plummy color. I'm gonna take this cypress umber color, which is like a dark brown. Put it right here on the outer corner. And then pull a little bit on the lower lash line. So I wiped off my brush and I take a little bit of this color called Fairy and put it right here in the middle. That's super cool, I love it. I'm just gonna use my Urban Decay Zero. I really love it, you guys. Such pretty colors. And it is, it's like fun colors, but it is soft. It's like they blend together really softly. And I don't have a mascara on yet. I did use, I told you guys, the Zero, the Urban Decay Zero liner, so easy. Such a good eyeliner. Try this too if you have it. That's also a Sephora fave of mine. Y'all know I'm obsessed with this mascara, the Louboutin mascara. I repurchased it, I'm so excited. I like literally just got it out of the box. It's like, it's like such a nice little presentation. Oh, you guys. So unbelievable, you guys. It's like, it's insane. It's so good. Look how blue it made my eyes look. So pretty. If I ever use shades that are very like warm and coppery like that, it gives me that effect, but I love that. That's so fun. So yeah, a lot of fun colors, but very soft. Y'all, this highlighter, okay, so you may have seen me talk about it in a few recent videos, but it is the Hourglass Champagne Flash, the Vanish Highlighter. And I, well, I'm already wearing it. I'm gonna put on some more, even though I used that powder earlier, whatever. It's so good, you guys. This is a good brush to kind of like buff it in, especially if you're putting it on over powder, which you probably never should, no, I'm kidding. I just put that powder on my face to show you guys. So I'm like, I'm like, let me try. No, you could even use this as a foundation brush, but I really love it for buffing. I could even use this with my cream bronzer that I like to use and kind of like buff it in if you wanted, you know, like a more like contour or even to buff in your contour or something, but this is so cool. So this is the Pro Slanted Buffing number 88, and I will link to that below too. This is fun, you guys. Now, I love Too Faced stuff. I think that the packaging's so fun. Such a cute little thing to buy right now during this event. And it's just the colors are so sweet. And for me, I like a lot of natural colors. I like a lot of, even if you don't do natural per se, like coppery or plummy colors. And this one actually has a lot of good ones or like pinky colors. It's got a few blues and a few different things. But really, you know, it's a lot of actual wearable colors, but they're so fun and different. I definitely didn't have anything like this. And then it's got this um, limited edition, or I think it's exclusive to the palette, the Unicorn Tears Highlighter which is kind of like a, like a bluish, you know, it's got that kind of, but honestly though, that's, that's really pretty. I mean, I would probably wear that and not worry about it. Just kind of blend it a little. It's actually really pretty. I hadn't really tried the highlighter a lot. The brush that I use too, this is the Pro Highlight number 98, so. So yeah, grab some fun and different things. Like try, you know, use it as an excuse to try some new things or try some really classic things like this, don't worry. I love buying fragrances during these events. Love this. I, I've never found anyone that really dislikes this. It's so unique. Most people that smell it find it very comforting. It's the Jo Malone Wood Sage and Sea Salt. If you have not tried this, you must. It is so good. It's such a good gift as well. Not, it's not one of those scents that like you either love or you hate. I think a lot of people really love it, but at the same time, it has a very unique smell to it. It has that like kind of beachy, fresh, sea salt, very like, you know, natural, but then it also has like a like a woody, kind of like a sagey, go figure, wood sage. A wood sage and sea salt. It smells like wood sage and sea salt. No, you guys, you just have to try it. It's so good, I love it so much. And it's just such a fresh scent that you could literally just bathe in and you wouldn't smell. No, you don't do that, but yeah, you do. But, but yeah, you guys, definitely check out some of my recs. I hope that you guys will try some of these things out and that maybe I gave you guys some ideas for shopping. If you are a Rouge member, then 
um, have fun and <laughs> start shopping. And like I said, if you are a regular Sephora Beauty Insider, go ahead and get your card started. And um, I will link below to all the info that you need, the codes for both events, the dates, the links, everything. So thank you guys so much. I really hope that you enjoyed this. Thank you to Sephora for collaborating on this one with me. And I will talk to you all very soon. Bye, guys.